Hello. Hi there. It's Jaja. Today I'm going to be reviewing uh, face masks from Society6. Some of you may know that I sell my designs on Society6 and if you don't know it is a website where you can get custom art prints as well as your art and designs printed on custom apparel, bags, uh, home decor as well as yoga mats, mugs, all kinds of stuff. So it's kind of like Redbubble too. I think a lot of people are famil familiar with Redbubble. Well anyway recently they started making face masks and I was very excited about that because I kind of wanted to express my own style in terms of face masks and I was kind of getting bored with the ones I had sewn at the beginning of quarantine. So we will review them in terms of their print quality, their overall material quality, and how they hold up after washing, as well as their fit. The masks themselves are very sturdy, they're well sewn, they're dual layered, and they do have an inner pocket in between where you can insert your own filter. I'm not sure how well that works. Um, I think people also have used paper towels to put in between the pockets and I have no idea what the efficacy of that is so don't take my word for it um, but it is there if that is an option that you like. As far as the quality of them, they're very nice, they're fairly thick and when I try to blow through them, it, I don't, I hardly feel any air at all coming through. So this one I have not washed yet, but I have used, and you can see like my lipstick inside. <laughs> but um, so this is like the original quality that, but used. This one I have worn and washed, um, hot water and put in the dryer to dry, and it's held up very well. Um, I think it's shrunk just a little tiny bit because um, if I put it, put it up against the other brand new masks, it is a little bit a smaller size and the material has gotten less stiff. However, the color has held up very well and the quality of the material is still very good. They come with these elastics. Uh, I think that they're a fourth of an inch elastic, which was there was a shortage of <laughs> like in March and April, but um, they're very comfortable and they stay on my face. So that's great. The fit is very nice. These are adult masks, by the way, and so far they're only selling adult size masks. And on my face, they're a little bit loose. However, they do stay on my face. And I have tried working out in these, so they do stay on at a workout, but although I wouldn't recommend working out in them because not a lot of air goes through and it's not very breathable at all. And since they are more of a sturdy woven material, they tend to accumulate moisture very quickly. So um, again, I wouldn't recommend these for working out. I have, have other breathable um, exercise masks uh, that I have bought from athletic companies. I have an Adidas one that is really good, um, but I wouldn't recommend working out in these ones. As far as print quality, I think it's very good. Uh, the colors are very true to my vision. And um, as far as the sharpness of the designs, I am, that leaves a little bit to be desired. Uh, I, I do sell my designs on spoonflower.com and their print quality is very good. And I have noticed that the print quality on these masks is not quite as sharp as the custom fabric I order from Spoonflower. So that's kind of a little bit of a miss. But still, they are very good quality. You can tell what the designs are. They're very um, intelligible in terms of what these objects are on your mask. Um, for example, these, this flower one is very vivid, very um, saturated, and I like this a lot. Um, the, my least favorite print that came out is probably this one, which is a design I made based on my dog. And I don't know what it is about this particular design that has made it so, but the dogs have come out a little blurry, so I don't know if it was just this particular mask and how it was made that made it like this, or is it because of my design? Um, I uploaded one that was uh, 
pretty high resolution, the original file, so it shouldn't have that problem. However, um, like I said, I was a little bit disappointed, but still you can tell that these are Yorkies and that they're pretty, you know, it's pretty uh, whimsical. <laughs> and the color is nice. This one is my video game print, video game controllers print. This was a vector uh, image that I made. So the lines are a little bit more crisp on it, but still like you can see like a little bit of a blur on them. So not quite as crisp as I would like. Same with this one, which is my um, comic book onomatopoeia print uh, created in Illustrator, which is a vector program, but still a little bit of a blur. In terms of these masks, I think they're wonderful. I think it's great. I would rate them. Let's see. How many stars would I rate them? Out of five, I probably would rate them a four out of five. Just taking a point off for the print quality since it's not quite as good, but the plus size is that the colors are great. They hold up after wash. They fit very nicely and um, they, you know, keep your breath in, your COVID breath, you know, near your face and not in other people's faces. So yeah, I think that's great. <laughs> oh, and um, I think it's also great if you want to express your own style, you want to express your creativity. I have gotten a lot of compliments on my mask. They do sell leggings and t-shirts and other things. If you want to match your mask <laughs> to your outfit, Society6 is a great place to get these made. I think that is it. Four out of five, great quality and hopefully you might want to buy some of these from my shop. The masks retail for $16.99, but with my artist discount as well as a sale that they were holding at the time, I got each mask for about $12 each. So it is a little bit pricey, but I think it's worth it if you want to express your own style and have your own designs printed on your masks. And if you like this video, you can go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I do art videos and I hope to do more art product reviews in the future. So yeah, stay tuned. Thank you so much. Hope to see you soon. Bye.